Hi there, I'm here today playing Gavat by Gossick on the violin. And I'm looking at my key signature and uh, it looks like I have one sharp, which is F sharp. So that tells me that I'm gonna be playing F sharp. And then I have C natural on the A string. And then I also have G natural on the E string. And then I sometimes have some accidentals, it looks like are gonna be coming up. Right off the bat, I have a grace note. A grace note means that I'm gonna be playing my first finger F sharp uh, quickly and then my G natural right after that as fast as I can. F sharp G, da da, da da, in a slur, okay? I am also looking at my uh, time signature. I have a, um, it's in cut time, which you can really think of as at four, four time, but just fast. So uh, if we're eventually gonna be doing instead of like da, 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 like that, we would think in, in two kind of. So bum, 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 like that, okay? Also, I need to take a look at measure 20, which is the hardest measure in the song, and that is the fastest, however fast I can play that song, that measure is how fast I'm gonna play the whole entire song. Okay, I'm gonna show you. Uh, measure 20, so make sure that you go down to the fifth line, and uh, the notes are like this. Here's my C sharp accidental, so sharp. Make sure you do fourth finger, not open E. C natural, back into the key signature. Then I'm gonna do it a, uh, a little faster. Making sure I get my C sharp and my C natural. Now I'm gonna slur it by twos. And now I'm gonna do it by fours. measure 20. You see how I figured out how fast my speed is based on how quickly I can do measure 20. Because I can't go fast on the beginning and then slow way down when I get to measure 20 and then go back to regular speed. That's no good. I'm going to take a look at some of these slurs down at the end. Measure 25. That's a C natural, and then I end on an F sharp. So C natural for my key signature here. F sharp. And now I'm gonna slur them by twos. And a few times on that. And now I'll do the whole thing. And I mess up, sorry. I need to use about this much bow for each of those short notes right after it. I'm in measure 25 and 26. Lift, it's the same thing. Practice that slowly. Bring that elbow in so you can reach the G string. And by two, sorry. And then now. Fourth finger. And now watch this, I go up twice. Up. Up, pizzicato, look, I just took my finger and went out. There it is. So, up, up, G, G. 
okay? After that, I have a DC alfine. DC means go back to the beginning, da capo. So in general, how I'm gonna play this song is I'm gonna start at the beginning, and there are a lot of repeat signs. I may not play all of them for the, just to make the video a little bit shorter, but I play through the whole entire page when I get to the end, DC, I go back to the beginning immediately and play up until it says fine, it looks like fine, and that's in the right in the middle and that tells me that I'm done, okay? So uh, now let's take a look at the top part because this is a little bit easier now that we've, t we've tackled all of those tricky slurs and 16th notes at the end. So now I'm at the top of the page and let's take a look at all of those grace notes and accidentals. And these are staccato, short notes. Make sure you get that. F sharp would be like on your tape and then low to G natural. I'm on the next measure, C natural. C sharp, accidental. Lift. That's the same as the first one. Here, now I'm smooth, no, no dots, no staccato. C sharp, high three. Look, I brought my elbow in. I'm really reaching for that high three. Three, four. Don't do it, don't try to go, but three, four. C sharp. So I'm gonna practice those two measures again. So that's seven and eight. Now I'm playing softly, measure nine. I should be repeating back to the beginning, but I'm gonna let you do that. Here it is at nine, soft. See how I play legato on measure 10. Nine is short, 10 is smooth. Also, nine has a C natural, and the reason why they did that, that's a courtesy marking. They're saying, hey, last measure you were doing an accidental, C sharp. Now we want you to go back to C natural in the key signature. We're just gonna give you a quick reminder. Uh, they don't need to do that, they just happen to do it, so. Sharp, natural, lift a little louder. Louder. same old speed. Okay, and then I go on from there. Uh, I realize I haven't gone on yet, so I will take care of that. Um, oh, odd tempo, that's what I was going to say, is measure 13 is just normal. Measure 14, slow down, retardando, slow down. Measure 15, odd tempo. That means go back to the old speed that you had. So let me start at 13 and I'll just explain all of that.
Thanks for watching.